Four left. Good club seats. Paid a bit back in the day. Honestly, it, um, it looks worse than it is. Um, um, um. Building a new shelf and units. Is it plumb? Of course it is, you nuns. Now, I know they say Rome was not built in a day. Well, I've got my new workbench in. Started putting some stuff underneath. Yes, 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 I know it is crap. I've got to sort all this out. I know there's crap everywhere, but. Once I bring in the stuff from out there as well, it'll be tidy crap. And then I can slowly sift through and get rid of stuff that I don't need. But yeah, I'm hoping that this bench is, is going to help because I can then stack stuff along here, build it up and not have it all over the floor like it has been. But yeah, we'll see how we go. Hello, I am Mr. Plum. We are Plum and Plumber. And I've been a bit busy in the workshop. So, or the garage yoss. Still call it the garage yoss, I think. So, this is really to round up what I've been doing this afternoon. Sunday afternoon. Can't be at work tomorrow. Oh. Anyway, Sunday afternoon, as you would have seen, I've had to get all that stuff out of here. And I decided to put a new, a new bench in, or an extension to the bench. Uh, which now looks like that. Is it perfect? No, no, it is not perfect. Is it a work in progress? Yes, it is a work in progress. Is it better than what it used to be like? Four million percent better. I can get the stuff now. Boxes are freely available. Things ain't gonna fall down on me head like they used to do before. I can now get some Iraq. I can now get some boxes and I can now get the stuff that was previously buried, among other stuff. So, it's not pretty, but and I'll need to spend the next few weekends, months, years, sorting all the stuff out, so make it even more accessible. Now, I can get to it, I can see it, I can get to it. That's the end game. So, yeah, but, I hear you ask, but Mr Plum! What did you do with all your gardening and barbecue equipment that you had in your garage? Well, I've got this. It's not a massive one, it's only four foot by three foot. No, not high. Four foot wide, three foot deep. Was it four meters? Oh, whatever it is. So it's like a small cubby hole. It's enough to uh, get the, the lawnmower in there, the rakes, the gardening stuff. Um, yeah, so the, the strimmer, get in there. And I'm thinking about putting a little shelf in there as well to put stuff up higher. And um, yeah. So it gets all that stuff out of the garage, which is what I want as an end game. Yeah, so get barbecue stuff out, get it all in the central area, and this will be like a proper, proper workshop thing. But yeah, if you recall on previous videos, the mess that I used to have around here, it ain't turned out too bad. So, yeah, so yeah. 
still need some work. And I'll just work over it the next few months. So something that you thought you may never hear coming from these lips. What about all the junk you used to have? All the stuff piled up to the roof. Go to the tip. Yeah. It's going to the tip. It was affecting me mentally. I couldn't see stuff. I couldn't find stuff. I was losing my rag. I've lost them as well. They're around here somewhere. But yeah. For my mental health, I've decided to ditch it. Ditch loads of stuff. So yeah. Anyway. I am Mr. Plum, we are Plum and Plumber, we've got a more functioning garage yoss, and I do things the way I do, because I don't know what I'm doing, and I shall see you on the next job.